everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude here, and I'm here to do a trailer review for Ghostbusters. That's right, the trailer for Ghostbusters, 2016 of course, with an all-star female cast, has finally released. And this trailer has been getting a lot of criticisms, and they've been mostly negative as far as I've seen, but... You know, here's honestly my honest opinion on the trailer for Ghostbusters. I don't hate it like everyone else does, you know, but I really don't blame the people that hate the trailer, though. But in my opinion, I say it's not a good trailer. It was okay. Of course, I'll go ahead and say what I thought was good about the trailer. First off, I really did like how this trailer started, how it said 30 years ago, and then it would say four scientists save New York, which was honestly very cool, and it says by next summer we're going to call, a new team is going to answer the call. So I really did like all of that, and I liked the piano piece that was playing during the opening of that trailer. Cuts to Melissa McCarthy, Kristen wig and that blonde girl that I know is from Saturday Night Live but I just don't know the name. We do see all of them and then it shows the ghost throwing up on Kristen Wiig which was kind of a whatever joke to me like it didn't really make me laugh but it was like okay that happened. But then as the trailer was going along the humor that they attempt at you know as far as I see in the trailer you know we'll see how the movie goes but as far as the trailer goes the humor didn't exactly hit it for me. Maybe a couple of times I kind of laughed and went, haha, that's funny, but for the most part, yeah, the humor didn't really do it justice. I did like hearing the remix of the Ghostbusters theme. Like, that's going to be so cool to hear. And, you know, I did really like the part where Melissa McCarthy and Kristen Wiig, they're like, let's go, wait, wait. oh, no, you can say next time. Like, that was actually a nice moment right there. I did like the visuals on the ghost, especially when you see Slimer, that was very awesome. The humor really didn't work out in this trailer, honestly, it really does fall flat. Leslie Jones, I know she's in Saturday Night Live, I don't really watch Saturday Night Live, so I can't really comment on her. Her character seemed very forced in this trailer, especially in that possession scene in the end of the trailer. That just felt extremely forced. Really did not work for me at all, to be honest. And even the execution, the timing in the trailer did seem to be very off, in my opinion. It was just a whatever trailer. I don't hate it. I think it's an okay trailer. I can see why it has gained the negative criticisms. I do understand. Um, but personally, you know, I just think it's okay. I still give this movie some hope because it is directed by Paul Feig. You know, I have hope in the guy, and I'm sure it could turn out to be good. Hopefully, it is a good movie. So, I do still have hope for it, but for now, until we get another trailer, I am honestly very worried. I'm really worried, but I still have some hope for this movie at the same time. So that's really my trailer review for Ghostbusters. But let me know in the comments down below, you guys, what you think of the Ghostbusters trailer. Are you with pretty much the majority that hates the trailer with the burning passion? Or did you guys actually like the trailer? Did you find a lot of the humor in the trailer to be very funny? I really want to know from you guys because it's always nice to get different opinions. So however you feel about the trailer, let me know in the comments down below. Also, you guys, very quick, I just want to briefly mention that I did do a live trailer reaction recently with Adam Haskell and WWE Fan 0599. That was very fun to do. No footage is shown there or anything. You would have to pull the trailer just because I'm avoiding YouTube copyrights, but that was a very fun thing to do, and if you guys haven't checked it out, I'll leave a link to that video in the description below. This is Tony, aka 22 Tiger Dude here, and don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power!